Hi, I'm Chastity Ray and I am a clinical PhD student at UND and I wanted to share some of my super favorite, probably super hidden queer joy books that I've come across. And I really, really, really love these books because they, every single one of them is written um, by a queer author and is set in a context where we are normalizing identities. You can see a whole bunch of different identities. They are main characters, they are secondary, char secondary characters, and they're all making community. There's even uh, a lot of conversation about how to build and make social change throughout the books, and so it kind of builds like a, a general like book world context of this is normal to have community, this is normal to have modes of activism, and this is, it also includes a lot of conversations about how do you recharge and where do you set boundaries and stuff. And it's all mixed in a super, super fun storyline. Um, so like one of the first ones I read was the Witches of Portland series, and that is an eight book series. And the first book in there is called By Earth, and it's it's set in modern day Portland, Oregon, and talks about a coven of witches and their different activist things. And each book has a different character with a different gender identity, and it's really cool. Um, another series by this author, T. Thorne Coyle, is uh, a cozy fantasy adventure series. And that one is two books long, and it starts with one called Mouse's Folly. And that one's adorable. It's got humans and uh, elves and dragons and, and mice doing these heroic things to make the world a better place. Uh, and so it's just a joy to read. Another series that they wrote is the Seashell Co. Paranormal Mysteries. And that one currently is sitting at six books. And the first book is called Bookshop Witch. And that one is another one that's kind of set on the west coast of America, and it's just about this um, this bookstore owner who has a talking cat, and there's magical things and magical beings in the world, and they're dealing with random stuff that happens. Um, there's also a post-apocalyptic epic fantasy, so the whole world has come to the end, and now we're living in a bunch of kind of city states in North America, and that one. Um, is three books long and it starts with We Seek No Kings um, and I really love that one because one of the books has a character who uses her pronouns um, and so I really love that normalization right there. Um, a really cute one is Paranormal Cozy Cordy Mystery series and that one is currently three books long and it starts with Sushi Scandal and features um, a gay couple and their adorable little dogs and a ghost and they're solving mysteries that are happening in their community. Um, and then they have uh, done a bunch of different books that are like magical short story anthologies. They have essays and supported writings on their website. And they have even short fiction stories on their website that you can plug into all the time. So it's uh, uh, www.thorncoyle.com.